happening just yet. Now that lone buffalo was there in front of the dam cam, I'm quite glad that James is following up, and maybe we'll have a hunt on our hands by the time the evening approaches. Ooh. Something has gotten their attention. Have I spoken too soon? Let's just watch. I don't see anything and I don't hear anything. But then again, it stretch all of that and kind of after it got warmed up again. Especially when it's cold. But remember that they're used to this lifestyle, so it's not as if they're getting cramps and things like that. I don't ever see one going on the ground going, ah, holding its leg. At least I haven't seen that. Look at them. Well, they have quite a... I don't know what it, it feels like a... Like a, a gang's just seen somebody that owes them money kind of thing. All the friends got up, and there's only a few that approach. And then the others are just waiting back, watching. Now, Dam Cam is not far from here at all. If the buffalo came through this drainage that's in the direction that they're looking at, it could easily pop up here. They can't hear anything. Send a scout out to investigate. Looks like they've got a beef with somebody. Ah, oh, there we go. Trish is back. Got a dad joking. Am I hearing a bit of a... So they're moving into this drainage which is very interesting because it basically links the dam can pan there and Gallego pan so animals can move between the pans between in this drainage he's gonna pop up Trishala should have view of him very shortly in fact if she looks down towards the game path She'll see him coming up to the top. No, she won't see him just yet. He's just stopped. I still can't see. There we go. And they're on him. They're on him. Let's go. Maybe go to Trish quick. There you go. There you go. Oh my God, this is amazing. This is exactly what they need. We don't want to move too much. All right, let's... Okay, I want to move, I want to move. Let's just get a little bit of a bit of view here. Here we go. They've got it. They've got it. Then we've got the one lioness in the back. Oh my goodness heart thumping. Remember, if you're sensitive to any of this, you might want to just look away for now. Wow, heart is pumping right now. There we go. I think we stopped at the perfect spot. This is absolutely insane. They are so close. My goodness. You can see that she's right on the buffalo's back. Now, this is the problem with being alone buffalo, a lone male, just by themselves, these are the most vulnerable. Look at her hanging off her. Listen, listen. There's another one. Alright, let's go, let's go. Oh, we still got a view, Davi. Alright, James has just gone around the back there, so we'll just stick here until we get a good view again. But this is fine. Alright. Right. Oh goodness, here we go. This is absolutely insane. Down into the drainage they go. Smooth. Got a bit of a visual here. Oh, they're chasing it down into the drainage. 
Now that's one of the things that they will definitely do. Try and get that buffalo to trip up. Can't hear any. Quick as you can. Shame. For you, if you are a sensitive viewer, I know this is hard. It's not pleasant. It could get very ugly. Going right sort of towards the camp. Oh, he's now into the camp. No, he's not. He's on the fence. Now, the lions will relentlessly chase him. They won't let him go. They won't leave him unless they get totally exhausted. And I think it's highly unlikely that they will because there are lots of them. He's now way up on the top of the bank. Here he comes, he's coming back down. They'll be running away, terrified that he's going to flatten one of them, which of course he could. There goes the male up after him, Mohawk. Now he's, he's quite cleverly got the height advantage. And he's going to try and keep that height advantage, but they're going to go after him. Patience, Bree. Can't always be on the move. There's the buff. All right. Round we go. across there they've got him sandwiched between the lodge fence and this great big gully and I think now there's a standoff they're feeling quite tired and I suspect that he's backed himself up against the fence a bit like he might against a buffalo thorn bush and he's now sort of thinking about uh, you know, whether to charge them or what to do about the situation. This is unbelievable. Yeah, I do, Lex, um, from Gallego, just basically to the east of the deck there. Look at this, this is unbelievable stuff. I think that's going to be your best view. I'm sorry about the radio, I've just got to keep everyone informed and we can't hog a sighting, we can't put two of us in the sighting of the other people trying to come here. This is unbelievable. All right, so Trisha's got a view. We're going to move out, I'm afraid, because Abel's coming here. Abel, what's your position now? Okay, when you get to the pan, tell me and I'll move out. What an amazing sighting. These little cubs came charging in here. I heard them kind of shouting and sort of growling at each other and I couldn't believe it was them. And now that little thing thinks it's going to hunt a buffalo on its own. And you might just be able to hear the lioness is calling them. Nico, you say buffalo hunters in the making. Yes, well they certainly are. All right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to pull out of the sighting now. Trishala's going to take over, and I'm going to just see quickly if I can get into Gallagher camp and see if there isn't a view from that side. Look how they're all waiting patiently. This, I think, is the worst part. Each one knows the fate of the other. And it is a waiting game. Up, oh, there's some movement again. Right towards us. Oh, 
Behind us, behind us. Okay, I'm just gonna stop here quick. Not that I can go any more forward or back. Just gone into a tree. It is, it's absolutely insane. Got a bit of an injury there. Sorry guys. Just forgive a Davi there. You can see there's a bit of an injury there. Ooh, a bit of a gash. That's just one of the things you've got to gamble with. Now I don't want to move. Crazy. Okay, thanks Em. So that injury, Emma says, is from the giraffe carcass that they managed to take down previously. All right, let's move. Oh, they're behind us, they're behind us, we're surrounded. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to move ahead and go to the buffalo. Meantime, these guys were right behind us. My goodness, I am completely surrounded. Look at these little bundles. Oh my goodness, what an epic. Here's the buffalo. He's just running past us. I'm just getting out of his way. Sliced and battered. And here come the lions. Trish, come along the shortcut from Shortcut Gallagher. They're on their way to Shortcut Gallagher. Is that a tooth? No, it's just phlegm. Okay. Only one lion following. I think he's escaped. I think he's escaped. She's given up. Well done. We'll see if we can find the buff again. You can be very, you've got to be very careful in a situation like that because they can run straight into you. But he just went past us. He didn't look like he was going to try and kill us, which was quite nice. Yeah, he's gone in here and she's given up. 